man. So basically, I'm gonna say this fight. I was in the tenth grade. Um, tenth grade. Yeah, I was around. I was about 16 years old when this happened. So we was on. Um, this happened around winter break. Like I had nothing. Had like no beef with that guy. None of that. Well. Yeah, it basically I, I little probably did it build up to something else. Like if it was probably like somebody I was cool with, I probably would have been like chill, relax, y'all. But this guy, yeah, he basically asked for it. But so basically, somebody I had I'm real close with. Me and him had an altercation. Um, me and him, the person I had I was real close with. We uh the guy for him first. Then. I guess. All right, that that went past. Then um, after that went past, um, it was so this was in winter break basketball. We still had basketball practice. This guy was on the fresh off team, and I was on the JV team. So I already had my practice or whatever like that. And after my practice, I wait for my brother that was on uh, fresh off. So, um, the, my brother that was on Fresh Off, he was doing, like, while he was having his practice, I was on the phone with, like, one of my friends or something, like, while waiting for his practice. Like, they was just warming up, like, before that practice even started. The, somebody, they was, they just got finished, like, doing a little warm-up drills or whatever. Um, after that, after that warm-up drill, some, somebody threw the ball at me. I was on my phone, looking at my phone. I was like, I was just, I just let it happen. Cause I just, um, I didn't let it happen, but I just let the, uh, the ball hit me. I was like, it was whatever. Then after that, the ball hit me again. I was like, well, hit, keep throwing the ball over there. You better stop. They had somebody just kept fucking with me. I was like, well, stop hit, throwing the ball at me. You better chill out, shit like that. And then they threw it at me again, and this time. The ball hit my face or something like that when I was on my phone. And I was like, yeah, that's dead. So I jumped in the middle of the practice. Uh, the ball came towards my direction. Like this person was an accurate or something. So when the ball came towards my direction, I stepped in the middle of that practice while he was practicing. And I was like, yeah, that's dead. I already told y'all once. Cause they was like, they was like freshmen and some were sophomores, but, and I was a sophomore at the time. But I ain't care because I was bigger than them and whatnot. Because, you know, it's fresh all. They like smaller players and whatnot. But it wasn't because they were smaller or not. Well, some of them was my size and shit. But my skill level was higher than this. But basically, as me being an advanced player, I guess, I don't know. I just I just went over there like, to defend myself. And that that's why I say. And I went over there. And after I went over there, after I went over there, the coach told me to take the ball. I mean, he, he took the ball from me. And he was like, um, who's ever, uh, whoever keeps throwing it, you better stop. And he said he was going to tell me. He told me he was going to handle the situation. So I was like, all right. So I let him handle it whenever, whatever he said he was going to do. I let him. I let, him handle the, I let him handle the situation. The ball came back at me again. And that's when the guy approached me. He finally had to like, I was like, whoever keep throwing this ball to me, come step to me right now. So the guy stepped to me. I was like, why the fuck you keep throwing the ball at me? And he just, he said, I don't know. I was like, you a bitch. I called straight calling him a bitch. I said, you a bitch for that. Cause it took you too, way too much time for me asking you to come over here. And he was like, what are you going to do? Or something like that. So I stepped into him. I was like, what do you want to do? So, Shorty tried to hit me. I weaved it. I ain't that weaved it. I stole him. It was a big old commotion. I was like, oh, he's fighting, he's fighting. Because they're supposed to be um, doing laps or something. He's supposed to be in practice. And he's supposed to even step to the side or something like that, the coach said. So he was in the wrong, the coach said. Trash in front of all his teammates. Mm. That boy ain't with nobody. 
He always got beat up though, huh? For some reason. I don't know about him. He always did something. He always done something. Like, I saw him beat up in the locker room before all that. He always in fights. He ended up transferring. All right. Out of the school. I'm going to say it now. But he ended up transferring out of the school. Like, I want to say his end of his freshman year. I was a sophomore when this happened. He was a freshman. So he's like a junior now or something like that. But. He ended up transferring out of school. And. Like. Mm. Well, he was like, when we were fighting and stuff. His nose bleed. Like, after I threw the first punch. He, he wasn't really hitting me. I just kept going face shots at him. Kept trying to hit me, but. You know, like when you have a fight, when you were younger. Like when you used to fight when you were younger, you see, yeah, your eyes get blurry or something, start worrying. You always cry for no reason. Even if you won, even if the person don't hit you, you cry. Like, we used to always cry when I was younger, when fighting. I used to be thinking about how my mother won't feel. Like, she was, she never cared for real. But she was like, why are you fighting in school? Got a little fuss. But like, she was like, did you win? I was like, yeah, I, was, I, was, I never lost a fight. I picked up everything. If I lost a fight, until I lost a fight, now I'll get a spanking. But if I won the fight, I won't get like a whooping or nothing. But this time, so this guy's nose was all bleeding. bleeding. And he started holding on me. Cause like, you know how boxes, like they hold your arms and stuff. I didn't want to hit no more. He was holding my arms cause he didn't want me to hit no more. Mm. He got hit me in the head lock. I died in the head lock. I grabbed him by his waist. I slammed him. Yeah, I had him in the head lock. And they trying to get me off him and stuff. He trying to get off of me. He trying to get him off of me and stuff. Mm. He trying to get off of me and stuff. Then the coach was like, the coach? No, no, no. It wasn't the coach. Basically, I had to get. I had to wash my coat inside the locker room. I had to wash my coat inside the locker room because they had all this blood on it. It was on the rest of my clothes. And some of his blood was on my neck too. That was nasty. I had to wash that. Soon I had to wash that out. I had to wash that off. I mean, not out. I had to wash that. After I washed that off my body, my bad. After I washed that off my body and stuff, my grandma was like, so I was practicing. I was like, it was cool, because she picked me up that day. My mother and father didn't pick me up that day. And I was like, it was cool. And she was like, why you got all this red stuff on you? So I, I didn't get all the blood off of me. I was like, I just got in a fight. And she was like, is that your blood? I was like, no. She was like, who blood is that? I was like, the guy I was fighting. Cause he, he had he got a nosebleed. Like I hit him in his nose hard. And I think I broke his I broke his nose. His friends and stuff said, like they said I broke his nose. Like the next day they like the next day they saw him cricking and stuff like in school. No no no, this happened on a Saturday practice. Mm. I broke. I broke buddy's nose on a Saturday practice and. They said his nose looked like cricket and stuff. This is before Corona, right? Corona, so he couldn't even hide with no mess or nothing. But they said it looked like he broke his nose and how crooked his nose was. And everybody was just making fun of him and stuff like that. But it was his fault. And I think he had, like, he was suspended from find a couple of games. He was never a good player anyway, so. By him not being a good player, he wasn't working no time anyway, but he, he got like less time. And like the big coach, like the varsity coach, like that, that was like the, um, he basically like checked the cameras and stuff and like how the fight would happen and who started it. He seen that he started it. He wasn't mad at me. And he told my friend, he was like that, he basically told my friend that I know how to defend myself. I ain't got nothing to ever worry about with me, like, 
like getting beat up in the streets or something like that. Cause like how I handled the altercation and how like how the fight went and shit like that. And I wasn't in trouble or nothing like that. He was like, just don't try, try your best not to fight no more. And stuff like that. I was like, all right. I was like, I was hoping that ain't fact my, me being on Wall Street now and playing basketball, but it didn't even matter because I didn't even matter because we ended up having COVID. And I couldn't play anyway. Because of COVID. You know what I'm saying? Talk. But, yeah, my grandmother, she wasn't mad at me either about the fight. Nobody was really mad at me. Everybody was just glad I handled my business. Because I'm not really like a fighting type. Like, I don't always start stuff. Everybody knows this. I don't really be starting stuff like that. Everybody know like I'm more of a lover, not a fighter and stuff like that. Cause I be like trying to stop the fights. Like I be I broke up multiple fights growing up. And and just try my best. Like everybody know not to try me. Cause like I work out. I'm real like mean sometimes i guess people say i look like i look mean but i'm really not mean if you get to know me um um what else oh yeah i'm not mean but everybody should just know like not to try with me well something happened he, um, he was unlucky he was wasn't smart enough he tried with me and he got what he deserved, you know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna end the video right there, man. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share with a friend, share with a friend, share with another friend, man. And I'm out, peace.